Millennial beauty Shania Kapoor is all set to make her debut with Karan Johar's Bedharak. But even before making her acting debut in Bollywood, Shania backed millions of fan following on social media and she is known for her high-end fashion choices. Now, the daughter of Bollywood couple Sanjay Kapoor and Mahib Kapoor has also become the proud owner of a brand new luxury car. Shania recently bought a swanky Audi Q7 facelift worth Rs 80 lakh and the pictures are doing rounds on social media where the happy family can be seen posing with the car. Meanwhile, Shania who is often seen sharing happy moments and glimpses on her Instagram handle recently dropped an alluring photo of hers posing on a rooftop swimming pool. She looked enchanting in a blue cutout bikini taking a dip in the pool against the backdrop of the serene skyline. A few days ago, Shania also shared a bunch of jaw-dropping pictures from the rooftop of a building where she can be seen donning an attractive green slit dress with her hair left open. Keeping minimalistic makeup, she paired her outfit with strap-on heels. Now talking about her work front, Shania unveiled the first look of her from the firm Bedharak and wrote, I am extremely grateful and humbled to join the Dharma family with Bedharak, directed by the brilliant Sashank Khaitan. I can't wait to kickstart this journey. I need all your blessings and love. Directed by Sashank Khaitan, Bedharak will star Shania sharing the screen space with Lakshya and Gurfate Singh Pirzada. In the film, the debutante will be seen as saying the role of Nimrit, while Lakshya will be seen as Karan and Gurfate as Angad. Reacting to Shania's debut announcement, her mother Mahib Kapoor had earlier shared her reaction with E Times and said, Thank you, God is kind. Meanwhile, Shania's big Bollywood break was long due as she had been leaving no stone unturned to prepare for the industry. In 2020, she made her debut in the industry as an assistant director for cousin Janvi Kapoor's film Gunjan Saxena, The Kargil Girl. For more such news and updates, stay tuned to E Times.